All right, crashing out of that story because uh, we are now joined in by the DGP of Nagaland, Mr. L. L. Dongel. Uh, Mr. Dongel, appreciate you for speaking to headlines today at this moment, sir. Just want to know from you at the beginning, what really is the situation on the ground at this moment? Just as of now, making all security arrangement, and we are being augmented by the Assam Rifles and the CRP also. And with this, we will ensure that is strictly enforced and no more violence is permitted in, in any case. Mr. Dongal, uh, what I would want to know from you, sir, is that uh, there is widespread criticism at this moment of the uh, of the security apparatus, the police that was deployed over there, that they failed to control this particular mob, despite the fact that there was adequate security arrangement, there was adequate police force. How would you tackle this criticism? Well, I will not say that police has failed, exactly, but then, yes, it's a case where we, we had to exercise a lot of restraint because of, uh, a lot of students also were participating in this petition. Why? In order to... And, uh, see, there's no uh, collateral damage. We could not react to uh, by responding with firing. To do all that and uh, tear gas, use of tear gas, and after all those measures failed, then we had to resort to. Uh, Mr. Dongal, uh, another question that I want to ask you, sir: Has any FIR been registered against the mob that was present there? Have some people been identified who actually went inside the jail and pulled this accused out? We have uh, uh, we have made uh, video photographs also, and from there we we will be able to trace who, who all have, have been involved. As of now, also we are making uh, arrests and then, uh, making arrests and looking for uh, those people who, who had did this offence. Have you identified those people, sir? Yes, we have the footage, and so we will be able to identify. How many people were there as a part of this mob, sir? And do you feel that in hindsight there should have been added or added or heightened security at that moment uh, over there where this this uh, mob justice was delivered? I cannot give the figure, but then from what uh, the I would see, there was a region of more than ten thousand. Mr. Dongal, do you think that the state administration failed to assess? Failed to assess the, uh, you know, the magnitude of this particular protest, the to the sheer number of people who were gathering for this particular protest. Did you fail in your assessment? I admit that there is some error in judge, but then it was not. Uh, it is failed. We had, uh, in the, uh, maybe there was a poor anticipation. That was because we we thought that it is to be. Uh, more or less a uh, peaceful procession and then also that since it is an in emotive issue that we will not uh, uh, too much of violence. No, no, I appreciate that, sir, that you are saying that the police was practicing restraint because this was an emotional issue. But the fact that a few members of that mob actually managed to enter the Dimapur jail and pull this accused out. Uh, do you think that some action can be initiated against those erring cops also? Who let this happen? I mean, how can people just enter a jail compound? The government already instituted an inquiry, so this will go into the details of how and what, what had transpired. All right, Mr. L. L. Dongal, the DGP, uh, thanks very much for speaking to headlines today. So, the DGP giving us a lot of uh, details as far as. Uh, what uh, the latest situation there at this moment is and also telling us that the culprits are, they are in the process of identifying who actually carried out this lynch mob justice uh, there were cctv cameras there was video recording that was being done by the police that's what the dgp is telling us and based on that an fir will be filed and the guilty will be brought to book so mob justice is something that uh, the police has already started or initiated an inquiry but uh, the fact is and the dgp agrees that there was an error of judgment as far as controlling this particular situation is concerned. Short break on first up, but news and updates continue right here on Headline.